In this Snagit review, I'm going to walk you through the software itself. So what is actually Snagit? Snagit is actually a web story builder that helps you design interactive landing page to engage your audience, to collect leads and also to launch survey. Snagit is actually very good for digital marketer, school, recruiter, which want to capture qualified leads, engage user and also get feedback. So without wasting much time, let me show you how to use Snagit. Okay, so what you're actually looking at is actually the main platform for Snagit. It's very simple, it's very easy. Okay, so what you need to do, very first thing is actually create a story. Okay, so just click into here and you actually bring you to what type of web story do you want to create. You can actually create a classic quiz or a survey. Okay, let me show you on the classic one. Okay, just simply click into classic and then you name Enter a story detail. Let me just create under Absumo. You can actually choose the language under English or French. Okay, just press next. So under you, you can actually create a web story and this is actually the uh, templates which you have under engagement, lead generation, flickback, event, e-commerce, recruiting or promotions. Okay, so let me show you other types of uh, stories. Okay. Let me just click out of here and create another story under quiz. Okay. Okay. Let me just use another story detail and press. Okay. So right now under uh, quiz, you have an under engagement, lead generation, events, games, or promotion. Okay. So you can actually see all the different type of templates. Okay. So let me show you the, the others, the other survey. Okay. Okay, as usual, just give a name. Okay. So you can actually see the diff there's actually only two for this uh, web story. Okay. So which one of that is actually feedback or actually events. Okay. So let me give you an uh, example of how to create this uh, web story itself. Okay. For uh, classic with uh, quiz or survey. So for this demo, let me choose classic itself. Okay. So from here, I just press in my name, type in my name here. Press next. Okay. So uh, under lead generation, uh, you can actually engagement. You can actually choose uh, any of them. Let me just choose, uh, maybe just choose this uh, template itself. Okay. So you for e-commerce and actually sales. Okay. So. For you can actually preview, take a look how is it like, okay. You can actually see how is it like. You can press the shop, the winter sales, and you can actually see the template itself. And you can actually capture your leads, okay. So if you want to use this, you can actually proceed to use this, okay. Okay, how to actually add dig? I mean, just I will just click into here, okay. So right now, what you are actually seeing is actually uh, the uh, edit function of this uh, template itself okay uh, it looks a bit complicated but i will actually uh, separate it into three parts okay on the left you can actually see uh, the number of page for this story itself okay you actually have the welcome page the sales page here okay and the sign up page or the order link page and the end page okay so this is actually for e-commerce okay so from the center Okay, so for the center over here, you can actually edit all every of the information here. All right, so starting from the top is actually a template, so you can actually choose different type of template. All right, and also the starting. This is actually the starting page. Okay, and also some page setting. All right, so let me show you the page setting itself first. All right, so for page setting, you can actually have some page animation. You can actually choose the animation length. Okay, you can actually choose the animation length and different you can actually choose none or bounce okay you can actually see the animation or you can actually uh, choose maybe slide in right okay so it depends on what type of animation do you want all right okay so right now you can actually see moving down you can actually see undo or you can actually click how this page will actually display all right so there's also a timer here you can actually click and do here and as you can actually see the timer, there's actually a timer here. 
Okay, if you want, do not want a timer on this page, just hover over it and then it will just display off. All right. So in any time, if you want to edit any of the information here, okay, be it whether is it the home page, sales page, sign up page, order link, or end page, okay, you can actually edit over here. Okay. So the edit function, okay, so right now you can actually see there's actually other uh, functions here. So right now you're actually in the edit page itself okay edit you can actually edit the background text image video shape tag location or calendar okay so for the background itself you can click on the back click onto it and you can actually change the background okay changing the background you can actually add a video image or you can choose a plain color okay if you want to change right now it's actually a video and if you want to change a video you can actually import it or you can just record it or you can actually put a link and uh, right now the link is actually from Vimeo and if you have any particular video you want to add you can actually proceed to add in here or you can actually choose from a pixel okay so you can actually choose from here uh, let me see if I let me just choose this and then it will actually change the video itself all right to the one which I chose earlier on okay so from here you can actually ending and then you can choose choose other video which you do not want all right okay you can actually reframe it okay so you can actually undo it and there's actually a playback speed you can actually put it normal okay times 0 0.5 times some 0 0.75 and you can actually in. do it as a number okay under normal okay you can actually put the start and the end you can actually loop it or actually auto playback okay you can actually put under cover contain darkness border you can choose the colors as well and the size okay so under text okay you can actually choose the title subtitle or paragraph okay you, in any case you want to choose you want to change a particular text just click into here and you can just choose the text style you can just change the font okay under rubric or you can actually change okay any of the text available here okay so it will actually change at your end okay you can actually put in the size okay space lining okay or text color you can change the text color different color all right okay so for this example i will just use yellow and the back color okay the background color right now is actually transparent so you can actually see the video bit and the background okay you can actually bold it italic it Okay, you can actually align, okay, left horizon, line, center, or right, and actually some vertical padding or horizontal padding. Okay, in any case, you want to change the text here, it's the same thing, you can actually change over here. Okay, in any case, if you have an image, you can also edit the image here. Okay, you can actually add an image, click and do it, you can actually import it, or you can actually have a link to the image, you can actually input here. Or you can actually get it from Pixel, or you can actually add a GIF sticker or Pixel Bay. So there's actually quite a number of functions already added in. Okay, so you can actually choose any of them. Okay, let me just choose uh, from Pixel. Uh, maybe just choose this. So we can actually have another additional image. Okay, you can actually add image at your end. All right, so you can actually see. There's actually an auto save here. So in case you lost, a, uh, you don't have any backup. So it auto save. So do not worry around that. Okay. So video, which I actually showed it to you earlier on. Okay. Okay. So let me just go into video. You can actually see the same function as I mentioned, or you can actually add other shapes as well. Okay. You can actually add a shapes. Okay. You can see the different type of shapes you have. You can add an emoji here and then it will be added here. Okay, you can actually see the emoji is black and you can change the color. Change the color to yellow so you can actually see. Okay, so in other shapes, you can actually add a tag. Okay, okay, so you can actually add a tag. You can actually add a title, URL, price. Okay, you can actually do a placement, text color, color. Okay, text color on the background. Okay. And also you can actually add a location okay for this part location and calendar okay i can actually show it to you but i is actually not on this 
welcome page itself. Okay, in order to show you the location and the calendar, let me move on to the second page. Okay. Okay. Before I move on to the second page, actually you can go scroll down to the bottom. You can actually see you will redirect to the next page. You can actually redirect to any of the page over here. Alright. So you can go uh, after you press start, you'll go to the next page. Okay. So the next page is actually the sales page. Alright. So let me press on to edit so I can actually show you the location. Okay. So since this, this is actually the sales page, you can actually add a location here. Okay, you can actually embed from Google Map. Alright. Okay. You can actually have some setting alignment, position, size, rotation. Okay. Opacity. Or you can actually add some, uh, this, uh, animations. Okay. Okay. So on calendar, you can also add calendar as well. Okay. You can actually add a calendar here. In any case, if you need it. Okay, calendar is actually work with Calendly, Tam Hub, uh, Tam Tam HubSpot, and Acuity, and you can book me, or you can actually add your appointment scheduling. If you need an action, you can actually toggle it off or on. Okay, and so this is actually an animation as well. Okay, so this is actually for calendar. So for other social network, you can also add other social network here. Okay, you can actually add active sharing right now. It's actually Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter. If you want to add more, of course, you can actually proceed to add more. Okay. Let me scroll up. Okay, so you can actually see the social share here. Okay. You can actually make it big old. So you can actually move the head. Okay, so you can actually move it. All right. Okay, so if you want more, of course, you can just add in more here. All right. So you can actually add more here. YouTube, TikTok, Discord, everything. Okay. So you can actually add in the link for whichever you have. And actually align it. Or you actually put in some uh, uh, animations. Okay. So this is actually for social networking. Social working. Okay. So in different type. Okay. So right now, since you already actually uh, done the temp edit site. Okay. This is just a, a quick demo. Okay, so you should actually align all these things. So after edit, you can actually go for setup itself. Okay, setup, you can actually choose the language, the user. Okay, choose the language, the user. Right now, we only have two language and the user as well. You can actually manage new user, answer notification, and actually see the version of it. Okay, okay, so you also can some uh, connects as well. Okay, this is actually all categories under connect. So you can actually have some connection. You can actually uh, connect under uh, for analysis and reporting. You should connect under Google Analytics, Google Tag Manager, Facebook Pixel, Google Sheet, Google Sheet by Zapier, Gmail by Zapier, Google Document by Zapier. You can actually uh, connect under any of them. Or you can actually do some file management, Dropbox, Google Drive, OneDrive, some uh, CRM marketing or, uh, automation, HubSpot, Slack, Intercom, Microsoft Team. Mailchimp, Twitter, Discord, okay, or some web hooks. You can actually add some web hooks, okay. So for share itself, okay, you can actually share this with uh, story. You can actually add a story, okay. You can actually assign a uh, a verb variable. It's actually optional, or you can actually edit the URL, the share URL. You can actually choose e-commerce, or you can actually put in my name as well, okay. And just save it. Okay, so it will be a different URL. Okay, so you can actually share your story by email, alright, or you can actually share the story by widget. Okay, you can actually see the widget positioning left or right. And you can actually customize the icon, full screen open, or you can actually toggle full screen opening, or delay after open automatically. All these are actually toggles. Okay, and you can actually add in the domain white white list. Okay, embed your widget here. The commands, or these are the commands you can actually embed it in, or you can actually share it with an iframe. Okay, you just copy and paste an iframe, or you can also share it with under a QR code. All right, okay, you should just download it under a QR code so yeah, people can actually see your stories. All right, so there's actually some analysis. Okay, okay, you can actually see analysis under desktop, mobile, tablets, or others. 
So right now it's actually empty. Okay. So basically this is actually snack kit. Okay. Itself itself. Okay. So it's actually very simple. It's very user friendly itself also. Okay. So this is actually an app sumo product itself. Okay. Uh, app sumo product. Let me show you the app sumo, the price of the snack kit itself. Okay. Right now snack kit is actually a one time purchase of $59. Okay. For a thousand response. 2GB file upload, 2 member and 1 workspace and white label. And if you want to upgrade to uh, more members and more file uploads, it's actually a $99 for second tier. And the third tier for more response and more file upload. And you actually have unlimited members. Okay, This is actually an uh, alternative for Typeform. Typeform is actually a monthly cost. So in order to reduce your cost for your business, you can actually... Uh, Purchase snack kit at a one time fee. Remember, it's actually a one time fee. It's not a monthly deal. Okay. It, and it's unlike type form, which is actually a monthly, uh, monthly payment. Okay. So it actually save your money if you use the snack kit. All right. And if you want more other tiers, you can actually upgrade more onto here. Okay. At the price of 59, I believe it's very, very worth it for getting snack kit. Okay. So if you want to purchase this snack kit, I will put a link in my description box. Go ahead and use my link. Then you, I will actually earn a small commission, but it will not affect the purchase price at all. So it's in order to support this channel as well. Okay. So if you love to see more reviews, such reviews, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any question, comment down below. And to the next video, I will see you guys. Take care. Goodbye.